Mary Berry is a national treasure who rose to fame as one of the judges on the Great British Bake Off. Following her exit from the show in 2016, Mary has continued to make cookery shows that will inspire and educate, with her latest show Mary Berry, Cook and Share set to air tonight on BBC Two. However, the famous TV cook's life has not always been baking and judging soggy bottoms, as the star has faced many highs and lows throughout her 87 years. Here's everything you need to know the former Bake Off judge, including her childhood illness, 55-year marriage and the tragic death of her son. Did Mary Berry have a childhood illness? When Mary was just 13 years old, she contracted polio and had to spend three months in hospital. This resulted in her having a twisted spine, a weaker left hand and thinner left arm. During her hospital stay, Mary just wanted her parents by her side but they were forced to be separated behind a glass partition. During their visits, I was in floods of tears, wrote Mary in her 2013 autobiography, Recipe for Life. I just couldn't understand why mom wasn't coming in to give me a cuddle, to talk to me and comfort me. It must have been terribly upsetting for them. Eventually she was moved to another hospital on a ward with children being treated for tuberculosis. While it was a traumatic ordeal, the TV chef said the forced period of isolation toughened her up and taught her to make the most out of every opportunity given to her. The other silver lining was that she had a renewed interest in domestic science classes and quickly started experimenting in the kitchen, which paid off and turned into a career spanning decades. Who was Mary Berry married to? Mary Berry has been married to her long-term partner and retired antique bookseller Paul Hunting since 1966, marking an impressive 55-year marriage. However, it actually wasn't so straightforward for the couple with Mary admitting to Sue Perkins' podcast an hour or so with that she played the field at the start of their courtship. Speaking about her multiple boyfriends at the time, she said, Paul was the London one and I had a Bath one, actually there were several in Bath. You keep your options open. It eventually took three proposals for Paul to succeed in convincing her, she refused the first time because he was drunk. The couple married at Charlcombe Church near Bath, with Mary revealing on the show she wore a dress that only cost £5 and made her own cake, according to Hello. The couple have two sons and a daughter, one of whom Thomas is a tree surgeon and the other Annabelle a professional cook. What happened to Mary Berry's son? Mary and Paul's second-born son called William tragically died aged 19 in a car crash. She had just welcomed her son back from university with a lamb dinner on a Friday, then the next day he went out in the car before lunch and never returned, according to the son. In the Mary Berry story documentary, she recalled the moment police knocked on her door to tell her the news. She remembered, it was about 1 p.m. The doorbell rang and a policeman was there. Immediately, I knew why. He said, there's been an accident and I'm sorry to say your son is dead. The staff were so understanding, the 87-year-old continued. They said, would you like to see William? He looked so beautiful and so lovely. His cold face. It was nice to say farewell. Mary Berry Cook and Cher will air tonight at 8pm on BBC2 and BBC iPlayer.